hello guys welcome to the youtube channel and in this video we are going to analyze we have a question is jude bellingham him i totally think it is it's him i agree jude bellingham is him he is the next big thing you know we had mbappe and Haaland in the goat debate who is the next goat i think we should start talking about jude in this debate I know most of you agree with me. You do agree with me that Jude Bellingham is him. And he could win the Ballon d'Or even before Kylian Mbappe does. Because just imagine what he's doing. He's, he has scored a brace today. And he has been on for a hat-trick. Jude Bellingham, today the game versus Osasuna, I think he's him. He has broken Cristiano Ronaldo's record for, you know, scoring goals in Madrid consistently, you know, since they ca he came to Madrid. And what amuses me, the kid is not even 20. He's, I think, 20, probably. 20. I'm confused. I don't know. But Jude Bellingham is him, guys. He's so good. If you watch the Madrid game, he commands play. He's in a mixture of, of Modric. Is it Modric making him good? No, but he was good in Dortmund. He was good in uh, this team that he was in, the, the ones that put on the blue kit. I'm forgetting. I'm, tr I'm forgetting, but he was in that team, and he was good. It's Birmingham City. He was in Birmingham, I think. Yeah, Birmingham. And he was the star player. He went to Dortmund. He became a star player in Dortmund. And he ended up in Real Madrid this season. And he's their star, man. He's the star of the team. And we cannot disagree anymore that Jude Bellingham is very, very talented. He's actually very talented. And if you see the position he's playing, he has not played that before. He used to be a bit back. But Ancelotti decided to put him a bit in front and he exploded. Jude Bellingham has exploded and he's not going to stop scoring goals. That is what surprises me. I've watched both games United today. That was something different. Scott McTominay. <laughs> I, I, may, I have another video for Scott McTominay and Manchester United. But Madrid and Jude Bellingham. Wow, what a game. And what a team. What I, 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 I am thinking, what I'm thinking is just... Ancelotti just needs to put a Kylian Mbappe in Madrid like this. Hmm? Just imagine they throw in a Kylian Mbappe. What are other teams going to do, man? They should other teams should just quit football when that happens. But of course it's Madrid and we expect them to be very very good. Madrid has a very high standard of football clubs and I think what they are doing is they are cooking. They are cooking this season, especially Jude Bellingham. He is cooking. We saw him in the Champions League. He was cooking. Probably he should do away with this celebration. Hmm? You know, he does celebrate like this after scoring. And he looks at the fans. I, I, I even wonder what that celebration means. I think, I don't know. But I'll google what the celebration means if you know let me know in the comment section subscribe to the youtube channel and we are bringing you more content coming in watch all the other videos too but i'm answering the question is jude bellingham him yes he is jude bellingham is him if you disagree with me that's up to you but I'll say, I told you, and I'll bring this video back when Jude Bellingham is holding a Ballon d'Or. Because it will happen soon. Because what he's doing this season, what Jude is doing this season is just phenomenal. And he will be in the discussion for the Ballon d'Or next season. Because we look at players who have performed. We look at the players who have performed this season. Just like Haaland performed the other season. So he's going to win the Ballon d'Or this time. No, Haaland has to win the Ballon d'Or this season. That's without a doubt. If he doesn't win it...
if Haaland doesn't win the Ballon d'Or this season, I don't know what I'll say to you, but he has to. And next season, the debate has to be on there with Jude Bellingham, Haaland also performing. No one else is in the question for Ballon d'Or next year. Haaland, Bellingham. Because Kylian Mbappe is not performing in PSG. And there is no World Cup, right? So, <laughs> probably they'll cancel it that like they did cancel for Leon Whiskey. But the truth is, Jude Bellingham is him. He is. He is him. That's the truth. Well, he has scored a brace. But let us talk about this Madrid team, man. It's so good. They don't have stars like they had before with Cristiano Ronaldo, Gareth Bale. They had all those stars, you know. The R9, the Beckham, the, the, the Galacticos. They, didn't, they don't have a sort of team that is like a Galactico right now. But they are really good. Because let us analyze. Vinicius Jr., a huge talent. He's huge. Vinicius Jr. is good. I'll not talk about Joselu, the striker, because he missed a pen. Why would I talk about that? He's, he, but uh, he's keeping the position for Kylian Mbappe. Because we know these things. Joselu keeping it for Mbappe. Then we have uh, this side. We have Rodrigo. He plays sometimes, sometimes he don't. Rodrigo is okay, you know. Then we have Valverde, man. Valverde is such a workhorse. Valverde is is good and <laughs> he has a special place in my heart because the work he puts in for the Madrid team is just too much. Even with an arm, I don't know if his arm is, is broken, but maybe it's just a, a form of style, but he's good. Valverde is good. Modric is 38, I think, but still on top of his game, even better than before. In terms of age, I think he's still playing so much on the top level. We've seen Cristiano Ronaldo at 38 is in uh, where where is he? Al Nasser, Saudi Arabia. We've seen Zlatan was in the US. He came back to you know AC Milan just to play around. But at 38 and still playing for Madrid, uh, that guy deserves an award. You know, just an award for that. Hmm? He he does deserve an award for that, but Madrid, wow. They have won the game 4-0. Four, four Osasuna couldn't even try to get to Kepa Ariza Balaga. But by the way, I also have a question. And it is very simple. What is Madrid doing with this guy? Kotua, the goalkeeper for Belgium. Do they have any plan for him or what is going on? I... I want to know if you're a football fan out there, you let me know in the comment section about the destiny, all the what they have in stock for Kotua. Are they waiting for someone to buy him? Because he's more like De Gea right now. De, okay, De Gea does not have a club, but Kotua looks like his goalkeeper number two. So let me know what that plan is. But Madrid, so today I saw Chumeni played center back. He's a defensive midfielder. But he did play center back and he bossed it with, uh, with this guy Rudiger there. Mm. So the Madrid team is all set and ready to just conquer. I think they are going to conquer La Liga. Well, for Champions League, I think City still have the upper hand in Champions League. And Madrid will only compete when they mix in Kylian Mbappe in their squad. If they put Mbappe in their squad, then... Of course, they'll, they'll stand a very, very high chance of winning the Champions League away from City. But of course, the Champions League is full of miracles. It's full of wonders. And yeah, that is what happens in the Champions League. But wow, Jude Bellingham is really him. It is him. I don't know. Let me see. Jude Bellingham starts. Let me read for you the starts for Jude Bellingham.
so some of the records for Jude Bellingham that he has broken uh, youngest English player to score in the Champions League youngest English player to start a game in the Champions League those are Champions League records So Bellingham went on to net his team's second, taking his tally for Madrid up to 10 goals in 10 games since signing for Madrid. Wow. Jude Bellingham is like William Shakespeare. Real Madrid make a bizarre comparison as England star scores again and match. He matched Cristiano's record, that is out. And he's, he surpassed it, actually. He surpassed it. Wow. I, I'm telling you, this guy is unstoppable right now. And he is him. Jude Bellingham is him, man. They have compared him to William Shakespeare. <laughs> well, man, okay. Man, he's, he's good. I, I accept he's good. And next season he should be in the Ballon d'Or list contenders. He should be number two. It's too early to predict, but I, I see I see the future. The, what it shows, I think he's going to to the moon. I Well, guys, thank you very much for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching this video. And I look forward to you subscribing if you have not yet liked the video and share leave a comment let me know what you think of jude bellingham i'll sign out of this video with his celebration bye